or welcome back to my channel. This is Marie Vicky, the Beahirang Bisdag sa Norway. Once again, thank you so much for tuning in to my channel and to all my subscribers and supporters. A million thanks to you. In today's vlog, guys, I'm gonna share with you the Petit Palais Museum and Picasso Museum in Paris. Okay? The Petit Palais, or in English, Small Palace, is an art museum in Paris. Built for the 1900 Exposition Universal or Universal Exhibition, it now houses the City of Paris Museum of Fine Arts. The Petit Palais is located across the Grand Palais on the Avenue Nicolas II. It is one of 14 museums of the city of Paris that have been incorporated since January 1, 2013 in the public corporation of Paris Musée. It has been listed since 1975 as a monument historic by the French Ministry of Culture. The construction of the Petit Palais began on October 10, 1897 and was completed in April 1900. The total cost of the construction was £400,000. Picasso Museum is an art gallery located in the Hotel Sally in the Marais district of Paris, France, dedicated to the work of the Spanish artist Pablo Picasso from 1881 to 1973. The museum collection includes more than 5,000 works of art, paintings, sculptures, drawings, ceramics, prints, engravings, and notebooks and tens of thousands of archive pieces from Picasso's personal repository, including the artist's photographic archive, personal papers, correspondence, and author manuscripts. A large portion of items were donated by Picasso's family after his death in accord with the wishes of the artist who lived in France from 1905 to 1973. The Hotel Particule or mansion that houses the collection was built between 1656 and 1659 for Pierre Aubert, Seigneur de Fontenay, a tax farmer who became rich collecting the gabelle or salt tax. The name of the building means salted. The mansion has changed hands several times by sale or inheritance although the occupants have included the embassy of the Republic of Venice in 1671. The Hotel Sally was selected for the Museum Picasso or Picasso Museum after some contentious civic and national debate. A competition was held to determine who would design the facilities. The proposal from Roland Simone was selected in 1976 from amongst the four that were submitted. In 1968, France created a law that permitted heirs to pay inheritance taxes with works of art instead of money. As long as the art is considered an important contribution to the French cultural heritage, this is known as a dation, and it is allowed only in exceptional circumstances. Dominique Bozo, a curator of national museums, selected those works that were to become the Dacian Picasso. This selection was reviewed by Jean Leymarie and ratified in 1979. It contained work by Picasso in all techniques and from all periods and is especially rare in terms of its excellent collection of sculpture. Upon Jacqueline Picasso's death in 1986, 
her daughter offered to pay inheritance taxes by a new nation. The collection has also acquired a number of works through purchases and gifts. Picasso once said, I am the greatest collector of Picassos in the world. He had amazed an enormous collection of his own work by the time of his death in 1973, ranging from sketch books to finished masterpieces. The Musée Picasso or Picasso Museum has over 5,000 works of art by Picasso including 3,700 works on paper, ceramics, sculptures in wood and metal, and paintings. This is complemented by Picasso's own personal art collection of arts by other artists. The museum has made an effort to present works by cartoonists who mocked or caricatured Picasso's work from the 1950s. There are a few rooms with ceramic presentations, but the museum largely follows a chronological sequence, displaying painting, drawings, sculptures, and prints. Other items include photographs, manuscripts, newspaper clippings, and photographs to provide additional contextual information. The second floor has a special area to set aside for temporary exhibition and prints. The third floor contains the library, the documentation and archives department, reserved for research, and the curator's offices. Since 1985, more than 1,000 exhibits have been bought by the museum. In the period of economic crisis and the government cut box on funding for cultural long-time director and baldassari still managed to raise 41 million dollars for the makeover by exporting arts for exhibition abroad the Musi picasso or picasso museum will raise between 1 million pounds and 3.5 million pounds a year between 2008 and 2011 from the touring exhibition masterpiece from the Picasso Museum. The tour helped fund refurbishment of the museum and included the Young Museum, San Francisco, where attendance topped 335,000, the Chinese Pavilion, Shanghai, the Art Gallery of New South Wales, Sydney, the Art Gallery of Ontario, Toronto and Palazzo Real, Milan. Upon the opening, the museum is expected to finance more than 60% of its annual budget. The full name of Pablo Picasso is Pablo Diego Jose Francisco de la Paula Juan Nepomucino Maria de los Remedios Cipriano de la Santísima Trinidad Ruiz y Picasso. Thank you for watching. See you again next Sunday. Bye.